This is Vinny, the spokesperson for Fox's Biscuits, and a bit of a gangster. And what do gangsters do? Amongst other things, they buy racehorses and run betting syndicates. So to launch Fox's new Amber's Biscuits, that's exactly what we did. We bought a racehorse. These rolled gold chocolatey new Amber's Biscuits are so special, I named my racehorse after them. Amber's, meet Amber's. Mm -mm -mm. And being the social kind of guy he is, he included his Facebook fans in everything. He asked them to help choose the silks she'd race in and allowed them to watch all her races online. He posted documentary content from the stables and got her the Queen's horse trainer to get her into shape. And every time she raced, his fans could win biscuits. He was so proud of her, he even commissioned a portrait of the two of them. Soon, Vinny's generosity paid off. His new fans generated nearly 30 million impressions as they liked, shared and talked about the campaign. A 300% increase on any previous campaign. And soon the media was talking about it too. Amber's trip to Ladies' Day achieved three national broadcasts, national press and featured across the globe. This increase in engagement made Amber's Fox's most successful launch in history, reaching two million households in well under half the estimated time. So remember, no Amber's Biscuits from Fox One. <laughs>